Hi, in this video I'm going to show you the new native compilation features of TD Mobile version 2.1. In TD Mobile 2.1, in the settings ribbon, we have <coughs> new items in the build settings. In the build settings, you can now enable a Cordova build, and with that, you will be able to compile a complete native application at least for Android and Windows on a Windows machine and you can create a complete project for iOS that you can then compile on a Mac to iOS. So what you need to provide is the publish app URL, that's basically the URL endpoint for the uh, web services that this application is using to talk to the back end. You define a target display, you give a Cordova project directory name, a package name that will be used for the app on the device, a version for the app on the device and then you choose the target platform here iOS, Android, um, whatever you like and if you choose Android then it, at the end you really get uh, a running Android application here in uh, right out of TD Mobile. So if that enable Cordova build is, in, is checked then in uh, the project ribbon in compile you do have compile to Cordova which is the native compilation and the compile to TD Mobile. Now let's start the native compilation process. You see all the output is going into the output window. Now the compilation is done and I can copy the Android app file to the Android device to test this. Now the application is being installed to the Android device and after installing it will be launched and you see the REST sample is now running on the Samsung Galaxy telephone here. Using screen, screen mirroring, I beam that onto my window screen. And you see the editable table window is working on an Android device. I have also copied the project source to my Mac and compiled an iOS app on my Mac and deployed it to my iPhone. And you see the app running on my iPhone now. It, you know, as so you see the uh, editable table control, you see updates being made just like on Android. Once the source code is on Mac, I can also deploy the app to an iPad here, which has a much larger screen in real estate. And here you can see that the uh, TD Mobile table controls can display many more columns in the table control. And again, you can edit table cells provide new data to the back end, save the things, and the data will be saved to the web service at that web service endpoint that you defined in the settings. OpenText Gupta TD Mobile 2.1 enables you to build native applications for iOS, Android, Windows 10, Windows Phone, and BlackBerry right from the IDE. Just set your build settings and you are ready to go. Download TD Mobile 2.1 from the OpenText website now to try all this yourself.